Yeah, there are times in my life when I've been wondering why. Still, I always believe, I always survive. Now I'm not so sure who to one good reason to try. What more can I take? I'm ready to buy. You think that maybe it's over. Not if you don't want it to be. I ain't gonna wait for a sign, your miracle. But stand up and fight. This is it. Make no mistake where you are. Your back to the corner. Don't be a fool anymore. The waiting is over, it's over. You make the choice of how it goes. <laughs> it's not up to me this time. Hey, good morning, good afternoon, y'all. Welcome, welcome, welcome to this place. That we call the mental house, right? I want to thank you for joining me this morning. And y'all want to know why I opened this up with Kenny Loggins? Because those who see, they get it. Those who don't, they still want to run around here and worry about these distractions like um, my booty hole brown. Stupid stuff like that. And I don't want to hear nothing about no generation because we have sank down to an all-time low. And that type of stuff for black children and black people, time is out for that ignorant shit. It really is. Time out in the whole nation to be looking at this madness and thinking that it's normal or that it's okay. Or you drugged out to the point where, hey, I don't give a damn. Shoot me up with some more Thorazine. <laughs> give me some more Depakote. I mean, I don't understand if y'all are aware or if your thumb is on your pulse and you see that we're on our last leg. You can see what's happening all around us. And for those of y'all in that Bible-thumping world, Y'all already know when the con uh, conflict gets around Jerusalem, that's going to be the war Armageddon, right? And the reason why these people know this, and they told you this in 1619, because they ass was planning it all the time. Because, you know, my God don't got no copyright. My God don't copyright books that say 1619. Those who have ears, let him hear. Let them hear. Let them hear. Let them tune in. Let them pioneer glands. Get cleansed. Get your antenna straight again, y'all, so y'all can see what's coming upon us. Because it's definitely coming. And for those of y'all who say, oh, I don't want to vote. That don't mean nothing. I'm done. If you are righteous and you believe in righteousness, then what you see is black people always being the moral compass for America. You notice that nobody really want to deal. Well, you got that one dude. I can't think his name right now. Because Fonnie Willis and Letitia James are so strong. 
look, forget about the brag, dude, because he's he gone. He just was out there smoke screening, and we don't have time for individuals like that. We need people who will go against the devil, the liars, the hypocrites, and say you will not, you will not steal whatever form of democracy we think we have over here. We just going to keep on beating on that beast until we get it right. But you will not come as an authoritarian and change my reality. You ain't, I, I, I'm not giving you permission to do that. And so for those of y'all, especially for uh, African-American, black people, coloreds, whatever you're calling yourself these days, if you let these ignorant Negroes Talk you into voting. Because I, I I don't believe, really, I wish it was more than two parties, to tell you the truth. Because uh, they both different wings on the same bird, right? Except for one of them is overboard one way and the other one is overboard the other way. Real conservative conservatism, I think a lot of us have uh, that. I consider myself a conservative person. I don't consider myself a damn MAGA Republican. Okay? There's some Democratic policies and principles that I totally, vehemently disagree with. Okay? And I will need to get into that right now. Okay? I don't, I don't even need to, Okay? But I'll just say one thing. Border. Okay? But with that being said, you don't cut off your nose and spite your face. And any sane and rational human being will uh, should understand that if you put your future in the hands of liars and thieves and bandits and think that you're doing something because you're not, oh, I'm not going to vote Democrat because all the blacks vote Democrat, so I'm going to vote Republican, you a damn fool. You are a damn, damn, double damn, 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 Triple damn, damn, damn fool. So all I want to say to you is beware. Look at what's happening around you. Look at what's happening. Look at Hamas. Look at Israel. Look at Ukraine. Look at Russia. What the hell y'all think we going to sit out here on the island and our turn ain't going to be? Huh? And we so damn scattered. Black people talking about my booty hole brown. My booty hole brown. Step up your game. Step up your game. And I understand being a young person, you always want to uh, uh, tip the envelope. That's the good part about being young. You're fearless, right? But you can't be fearless and foolish. Pick one. It's okay to be fearless. But you can't be foolish with it. And nobody care about your sexual genitals and that type of shit because everybody got them. Everybody got a butthole. Everybody got a, either a, 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 a penis or a vagina. Unless they didn't remove them. Right? Okay. So, we don't need to hear that. What we need for other young people to do is do be like Fred Hampton. Wake up your generation. Wake up your generation and let them see what's... Uh, and unless you don't know. And then that means you got a, 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 a short period of time to get your mind right. Because if you can't share nothing other than your booty hole brown, whatever, if that's all you got to share, and that's all that's important to you, then we can't use you, no, we can't afford you. And y'all need to uh, do something about that. Y'all need to stop supporting that. That's not important. Okay, because it's nation time, people. It's nation time. The mothership is coming. It's damn near landing. And I know a lot of y'all ain't gonna like what I'm saying to you, but I really don't care. This is it. Make no mistake where you are. <laughs> you can't go no further. Don't be a fool anymore. The 
when it is over, over. All right, y'all. I don't know who agree with me or who disagree with me. But that was the message that I wanted to get out this morning. And I really, really, really thank y'all for supporting the Mental House TV. I appreciate it. There's going to be some changes coming here. Um, and we hope you continue to support us. I love you all. I want y'all to go out and, you know, make it a good day. Uh, it's really raining and gloomy where I'm at. But nevertheless, I got to be grateful that I'm on this side of the dirt and I got to go out and make a, the best of a bad situation. With that being said, may God bless you and keep you until we meet again. Like, share, and subscribe to my channel. And let me know what y'all think. Leave your comments, and I'll see you in the next one.